everyone, uh, welcome to my channel Keep It Beautiful EXO. I'm Aisha and today I'm going to be doing my first tutorial. And I'm really excited because, um, yeah, it's my first tutorial. So today's tutorial is actually going to be a no makeup makeup look. So if you guys were wondering if I had any makeup on, no I don't. Shh. Okay, yes I do. But it doesn't look like it do, which is the whole point of this video, is to look very fresh and, you know, summery and dewy skinned uh, without looking like you have, like, makeup on. Uh, just for those days um, that you don't feel like, you know, leaving the house without makeup, but you don't want to look overdone. Um, it's perfect for school. I know some schools don't allow um, people to wear too much makeup, so this is like perfect for that. Or if your parents don't really like you wearing a lot of makeup, this is also perfect for that. So if you guys want to see how I kind of did this um, look, just keep watching. The first thing you're going to do is just start off with a nice clean face, and then you're going to take... Um, your favorite moisturizer. I'm going to be using Neutrogena's uh, Healthy Defense Daily Moisturizer. It has SPF 45, um, which is really good um, in the summertime especially because you don't want to like, you know, I mean you want to protect your face from the um, sun. So I'm just going to smooth that all over my face. Alright, so once that's done, um, you could either put on foundation, but I typically don't like wearing foundation in the summer especially, but if you were to wear foundation, um, just to make it a bit more light and natural looking, you can mix it in with your moisturizer and just use that as like a tinted moisturizer. Um, but I'm not going to do that, I'm just going to conceal any um, areas of my... Um, MAC uh, Pro Longwear Concealer, and I am in, if you can see that, NW40. So I'm just going to conceal any areas, like um, my dark circles, and then I have a few like um, marks over there that I would want to conceal, and just any dark areas that you have, just to overall brighten up your face and, yeah, just give you like a nice clean um, complexion. When you're concealing your under eyes, you just want to go in a triangular um, kind of, uh, what's it called, motion? Yeah, okay. A triangular motion from the tip of your nose right here um, to the outer edge of your eye and then to the inner corner. So once that's done, you're just going to take a setting powder, a really light one. I'm going to be using uh, my MAC Studio Care Blend uh, Press Powder. And just any kind of loose powder would work, um, but since I don't have loose powder, this works fine. And something that's just really lightweight and just to kind of, you know, slightly mattify your face, um, but not where it's like noticeable. So I'm actually going to use just this puff that comes with it because I actually really like it um, and just kind of put it on my t-zone and where I um, usually get a little oily even though I for the most part have like dry to normal skin but I do get um, a little oilier in the summer um, so I'm just gonna do that and yeah So I want a really natural looking cheek and a good way to do that is just a lipstick because they are super creamy. You can also use a cream blush but I find those can be a little too pigmented. This really dark one and honestly it doesn't show up this dark um, on my cheeks. It just kind of looks like, you know, I just went on a jog and I'm naturally um, kind of flush.
Alright, so that's all I'm going to do for the face, and then now we're going to move on to the eyes. So for the eyes, you don't want anything too dramatic. I'm just going to show you a quick trick just to, you know, thicken up your um, eyelash eyelashes a bit more without looking like you just put on a whole, you know, ton of mascara. So I'm just going to zoom you guys in so you can see better. I'm going to be using this um, Dior waterproof eyeliner. It just looks like that. And it has like... Uh, there we go. So it has a really nice formula. Um, it's super creamy, so I'm going to be using that. So maybe I should zoom it in. Yeah, so you guys can see a little better. Okay, there we go. So you're just going to take the eyeliner and you're just going to kind of massage it into the like base of your lashes. Um, not the waterline or the tight line, just kind of smudge it into the um, roots of the eyelashes. You can do little dots. I'm just going to smudge it in there. This will just give the illusion of like thick, nice eyelashes. So I'm just going to do that to the other eye now. Okay, so since I... Let me just zoom you guys out. Um, you could add a little mascara, which I'm actually going to do, um, just because, um, I don't know, my eyelashes look really tiny. If you want, you could like curl your eyelashes. Um, that works perfectly, but I don't know where my eyelash curler is, so I'm not going to do that. Um, I'm just going to take a little bit of this Falsies mascara, and I'm going to, I just like the brush, because it gives a really nice um, coat, but I'm going to just like take off whatever is on the brush and then I'm just gonna do like a little bit of mascara just to kind of um, you know show that my eyelashes are actually there all right you could do the bottom but um, that would just look a little too overdone so that is it for the eyes and the last thing I'm gonna do is the lips so since this is since this is a no makeup makeup look, um, it is a makeup look, so I am going to do more than just a little chapstick. You could just like stop with um, just chapstick. I'm using um, Cherry Chapstick from the Chapstick brand. <laughs> this is my favorite. Um, works amazing. So I'm just going to moisturize my lips first. And yeah. Then I'm going to be using my Revlon, um, is that upside down? Yeah, it is. Okay, my Revlon Rosy New. Just on the bottom though, and then I'm going to blend that in with the top. And then you can just blot off whatever. Alright, so that is it for the uh, no makeup makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed and yeah, I really like this look. So if you guys have any more requests, you can leave them down below and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.